all right guys welcome back to another video it's game rock uk here and i hope you are enjoying the video so far today i'm going to tell you a really it's easy you're going to need some people to kind of help you though if you don't know how to do solo runs but this uh this is a really good way to make money you can make massive amounts of money doing this and it's something that you're probably doing every day anyway but you may not have realized how much money you can make doing this. So let's get right into it. Before we begin, though, make sure you hit that like button and hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. Let's get right to it. So today, let's talk about timeless shards, okay? And how much money you can make from farming the timeless shards. Now, how do you get timeless shards? Well, you get timeless shards from looting elite chests. Uh, so if you do your elite runs every night, every day, I say every night, uh, you might do them every night, but every day, um, you know, when you're doing Merc, when you're doing uh, Mel Valance, uh, Mines, uh, Sirens, Eternal Pools, uh, Dynasty, you know, you like, you've got a chance to get Timeless Shards. Now, what do Timeless Shards look like? What do they do? Well, this is what they look like. I've got a Ring Shard on me right now. What they do um, is they give you a specific attribute for that specific a, 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 a specific item. So, for example, say you're making a ring. This one's going to give me a certain attribute for that ring. So let's have a look so you guys have a good idea. So let's go and go to the uh, dual crafting station. Uh, also known as an outfit station. Um, let's uh, head over there. I keep forgetting where the outfit station is in this place. Uh, do, 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 do. There it is. Over here. I was literally right next to it. Okay. Can we cut that from the video, please? Um, all right. So what you want to do is you want to scroll right to the bottom. Is you have to be level 200 to to use the shards by the way so if uh if you've got like uh say you've got like uh, a warhammer one you're gonna have to have 200 weaponsmithing in order to be able to use that shard i've got a ring one so i have to have 200 ring uh 200 ring 200 dual crafting in order to craft to use it okay because if you you see these all level 200 if i look at a level 160 and i go to 150 it's not going to give me any timeless shards uh it's not going to put the timeless shards on the on the on the on the uh, screen so i won't be able to craft with it so it's not gonna if you're less than level 200 you're not going to be able to utilize them so I'll just explain a bit about timeless shards before we go on to the actual money making part. Um, so, as you can see, once you hit level 200, the timeless shards then comes at the bottom. Now, what it'll say on the right hand side here is what the actual um, perk will be. So, it will give you a specific attribute. So, if I make an emerald ring, it's going to give me plus 20. Um... And it looks like strength is sort of what it's going to give me. Or intelligence if I do a moon, moonstone. Um, but it'll basically tell you here what you want. So it's going to be plus 20 strength. Or intelligence. Which is really good for me. Because um, I'm, uh, I'm obviously a mage. So intelligence is really good. But that's not where the money comes from. So the money comes from selling these on the trading post now obviously each server is going to be different and you know i can't guarantee you're going to make massive amounts with this and to be honest over time you're probably going to make less and less over time uh because the longer the time the shards are out the more of them that are probably going to be flooding the market um so um so only sell the ones that you're like absolutely uh have to sell so let's uh let's just take a look at the trading post real quick uh, so i sold an ambulant one earlier because it was just dexterity it was a dexterity one i'm not dexterity built i didn't need it so i got rid of it and as you can see here timeless ambulance shard eight thousand gold i got from it 
eight thousand gold now i got that just from doing an elite run yesterday easy eight thousand gold now obviously every server is different and as i said the longer this uh the time of shards will be out the probably less you're going to be making but i reckon you're still going to make at least a thousand two thousand per time of shard even after a few months so you're still going to get a decent amount so um let's have a look at the ring one that i've got here so let me just scroll down to the ring one so the one that i've got here the people are trying to ask for three thousand for it but the cheapest one on the market is actually nine thousand if i put that out for nine thousand that would sell pretty quickly um and i would get nine thousand because people are paying that price people are paying such big prices for time of shards it's unreal so how can you get your time the shards let's talk about that so as i mentioned earlier elite runs is look if you're on an active server look for people running elite runs do your mines do your merc do your do your uh malevolence malevolence however you say it uh do your pools runs do your sirens do your do your imperial palace you know do your elite runs every day if you can and you will you might pick one up you might pick a couple of them up i picked up two yesterday doing and and i only did five uh, elite runs so i did the mines i did merc i did malevolence i did sirens and i did pools and i picked up two i sold one of them for 8k i kept the other one easy money easy gold such an easy way to make money guys you just need to do your elite runs so on most servers, there's going to be elite run groups doing elite runs. Join in with them every single night. You're going to get your timeless shards. You're going to be able to make bang for your buck. Easiest gold you're ever going to make on New World. And I'm telling you, it's just super cool. Like, I wouldn't make this video if I didn't think it was the easiest money ever. Like, why would you go out farming millions of resources to craft things to make a thousand gold when you can literally just go out do an elite run pick up a timeless shard if get lucky 8k boom in the bag easy anyway guys i hope you enjoyed the video um and i just wanted to you know, you know let this be known that how easy it is to make gold now i i totally do understand that not everyone will get timeless shards every time they run elite runs they are a rare drop but i got two yesterday running five elite runs they're not as hard to get as you think. And even if you don't pick one up every day, there's still big money to make, be made off timeless shards. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that like button and that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.